What were your goals heading into MLB 14? Uh, PS4 specifically, make it great. Uh, we wanted feature parity and we wanted to make sure the game was 1080p, 60 frames per second, year one, right out the door. Our second major goal was to give users a way to play more baseball with less of a time commitment. And we think we've done that with our quick counts feature, our new player lock, which is roll to the show anywhere feature, and some other things we've done from the presentation side. What are some of the new gameplay dynamics? Ooh, quite a bit. Um, we have over 500 brand new animations. Uh, from a base running standpoint, we ripped out all of our old base running code. We ripped out all of our old base running uh, animation core. That's all new. We've completely recaptured our catcher animations, so we started over from scratch, and those are things you'll see on both platforms. And that's just the start. What do you think baseball fans will be excited about when they get to play MLB 2014? Uh, a little bit of everything. Um, Regardless of the console, and I, I, we, we keep talking about this, is the pace of games. Uh, if you want a faster, more engaging, still simulation experience, you can do that. Uh, the evolution of Road to the Show, we've really looked at what people didn't like about Road to the Show and what we need to do to take it to the next level, and we think we've done that. We also have this brand new feature that has nothing to do with anything we have ever done before but called communi Community Challenges, and that's something that we'll be talking about in the coming weeks. How will the game interact with the PS Vita? Uh, PlayStation Vita, uh, basically all of the features that you have on the PlayStation 4, like um, your share button, your share button will work as, as well. If you want to do crossplay, we still have crossplay and home run derby, and that'll work from PS3 to Vita and the PlayStation 4.